pink creamy alfredo pasta it's a yes for me but here's the catch there's no cheese and it's full of veggies and full of fiber and really 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 good for you and of course it's perfect for valentine's day i just roasted cauliflower shallot garlic and beet that's going to be hidden inside the sauce we're going to just put everything in the Vitamix. It's really easy. This is a vegan parm. You can also use nutritional yeast. This is just cashews and sunflower seeds, salt, garlic, and did I say nutritional yeast? That's all in there. This is optional. Some vegan butter and cashews. Super easy. If you don't have a Vitamix, you can just use a high-powered blender. If your blender doesn't get warm, you can blend all the ingredients together and then heat it over the stove in a saucepan. But since the Vitamix gets everything nice and warm, we can put everything in here. We're going to have the base be veggie broth, cashews, vegan parm. Again, optional, but if you want to, the butter. And then our roasted veggies. Obviously, it's already cooled down because I'm not wearing my oven mitt. I love roasted garlic. It's so good for you. And beets. Beets are what naturally color this creamy pasta so it's beautiful and delicious beets are a food that if you can eat them every day you'll be doing so well they're incredible for your heart and for blood flow of course they're full of fiber as well as the cauliflower you can add salt and pepper i already did that when i roasted the veggies the veggies just had olive oil and salt and pepper so i don't really need to re-salt and re-pepper this <laughs> great thing about the Vitamix is that you can get your soups or your sauces steamy. I've had this Vitamix for at least 10 years, maybe longer, maybe 10 or 12 years. The same machine and everything. It is definitely the most used tool in our kitchen. Let's taste it. It's delicious. Mm, Alex, I think you're even going to like it. Our pasta is done. I use chickpea pasta. I really like chickpea pasta. And our sauce is still nice and steamy. Mixing it all up, covering all the pasta. Make sure that when you drain your pasta, you don't run it through water. The sauce will stick better. That's pretty. Tell me that's not pretty. And if you want to sprinkle a little bit of vegan parm on top or regular parm, whatever you want to do, and you're done. It's easy. It's full of hidden veggies. It's great for your heart. And it's also beautiful for Valentine's Day. It's amazing. You wouldn't know all those hidden veggies are in here. Mm, I love beets. Let me know if you're going to try it below and tag me when you make it.